Vantage Point with True North Wealth Partners is for our clients and those wanting to learn more about what's really going on within the markets and economy, as well as overall financial planning topics. Hey, everybody. This is a special early December holiday episode. Just wanted to recap a few things from episode 40 that was just pushed out a couple weeks back. Hopefully you caught that. A couple highlights was just uh, the used car mayhem index. Where those prices are going lower. Inflation, the CPI has come down, but still overall inflation is higher for longer. Um, you know, a lot of uh, uh, tips of the month that were produced there, new house builds. Uh, those folks are getting creative with their packages, designs, buying down mortgage rates, lowering prices around 6%. Uh, VIX has been uh, around 13, artificially low for now. We did have a little bit of a Santa Claus rally the past three plus weeks. We'll see if it holds into the month of December here um, and a lot of other things. So please check that out. I did want to take this time just to go through a few things for the month of December heading into the holiday season. So and this chart here is from NDR, Ned Davies Research, one of our, our, our research partners there. Uh, Nathan, our producer, will go through some great charts we're going to put up for you. So as you see this in yellow, we're heading into a seasonal, the uh, cyclical effects here, November, December, into January, February, March, April, with the parts that are highlighted in yellow. Those are some good months, good returns, typically. So again, uh, November's kicked off uh, the most bullish stretch for the cyclical over defensive leadership. So I want to at least put that in perspective, a visual for you. Whether it holds up this time or not, we'll see because a lot of the parts of the rolling recession uh, that are going to hit here in the Q1, first quarter of 2024. So we'll see what happens. But I just want to give you historically what has happened in the past. Um, some great new charts here from True North that we've, uh, um, now the IRS has come out and finalized all the publication um, limits and contribution charts. On this next one, uh, we'll put up here, you'll see, um, this is just a, a summary guide uh, in regards to the AGI, adjusted gross income, versus the modified AGI of who can deduct what and what you're eligible for. So it's just interesting to see, you know, what's deductible for IRA contributions on the top left there, deduct the following. If you're a W-2 earner, uh, student loan interest deductions, uh, you can uh, exclude foreign income, adoption expenses, et cetera. So when you see the little plus marks, um, that means you're able to uh, de- what falls into uh, your modified adjusted gross income and what does not. So it's a nice little summary sheet. I uh, thought that might be useful uh, heading into uh, 2023, doing taxes, excuse me, heading into 2024, but also doing taxes for 2023. So I thought that would be uh, uh, pretty insightful. 2024 now, this other chart is important numbers. Uh, again, these are all finalized. So this is pretty cool. Uh, there's two parts to this, a front page. So in the front page, just wage base. So Social Security basically has uh, increased it to $168,000 uh, for Social Security wage base. So they can, you know, was, you know, 105000 110 125 up, up, up. So again, that's the silent little tax hit that we're all paying. Um, so just be aware of that. The COLA for next year, cost of living adjustment for uh, Social Security is 3.2%. Um, so uh, be aware of that. And then they adjust the brackets due to the COLA cost of living. So all the brackets have gone higher as well. Um, and on the back side of this, it's pretty interesting too. You'll see contributions. So for 403Bs and 401Ks, you can contribute uh, $23,000 per year into your 401K. The catch-up for those folks who are over the age 50 is 7500 So again, Twenty-three thousand plus seventy-five hundred. So that's thirty thousand five hundred dollars. One can sock away into a four hundred three B, four hundred one K, four fifty-seven, etc. Um, in addition, other things I want to point out is the uh, IRA contributions. So Seven thousand dollars you can put into a Roth or a, tr- a contributory IRA. One or the other, not both. And then the catch-up. Once you're over the age fifty, then you can do a thousand-dollar catch-up. So that's a pretty in the middle part there. That's a pretty neat little uh, tool that, to remind yourselves of. And then one other item on the bottom right there, you'll see the lifetime exemption, the estate and gift tax. <clears throat> the exemption now is $13,610,000. Uh, 
Uh, but you can gift up to 18000 It was 17000 Now it's 18000 So you can gift up to $18,000. No penalty, no tax implication for the giver or the givee, <laughs> donor or donee. So uh, that's pretty nice too. So I thought this little chart, uh, we have all this, all of your advisors here at True North, we can provide that to you. Uh, but we wanted to at least visually share it with you that way. Um, some other things, moving into the final chart, is this uh, a summary too uh, for Medicare costs and premiums? So it's a nice little grid. Uh, you'll, we have this available for you as well. So uh, a couple things is just to keep in mind are the increases. So the increases... For Part A, obviously the premium's uh, free. Uh, part B, that premium is uh, one seventy four seventy, so let's just round it to one seventy five. So approximately one seventy five a month will be your Part B premium starting in January twenty twenty four. Part C, Medicare Advantage premiums. The average here, uh, it's basically eighteen fifty, eighteen dollars and fifty cents up uh, slightly from last year. Part D, Part D is a uh, prescription drug. Uh, that is fifty-five dollars and fifty cents. That's the average. Um, is fifty-five fifty. So uh, keep that in mind. Um, uh, just a nice little summary report for that. So hopefully you find this a little bit useful information. We appreciate you uh, for this year, the past twenty twenty-three. All the advisors here on behalf of uh, Stacy, myself, Andy, uh, Jim, Eric, and Russ. Uh, have a great holiday season with your family and loved ones. Please reach out to us. Again, well, we've been doing a lot of the year-end uh, Roth conversions, charitable gift planning. We've been doing all that the past few months. But if you need any questions about anything, want us to do anything on your behalf, reach out to us. We're here for you. Enjoy the holidays. We'll see you at the next episode, which will be released at the end of December for our final episode of uh, 2023. Take care. Thank you. You can reach this episode on our website at mytruenorthwp.com, by other podcast venue sites, or by calling us at 614-929-2715. Also, feel free to share this episode with friends and family and sign up for our weekly email market updates via our website. Special thanks to our producer, Nathan, as we will be producing these episodes on a monthly basis. Investment advice offered through Stratus Wealth Advisors, LLC, a registered investment advisor. Stratus Wealth Advisors, LLC, and True North Wealth Partners, TNWP, are separate entities. The opinions voiced in this show are for general information only. Information presented on this program is believed to be factual and up-to-date, but we do not guarantee its accuracy, and it should not be regarded as a complete analysis of the subjects discussed. This content does not constitute the rendering of personalized investment advice. A professional advisor should be consulted before implementing any of the options presented.